Rihanna is known for being the ultimate chameleon. She can pull off any looks. Edgy, sexy, glamorous, and my personal favorite, the bad girl look. Ready to become one too? All right, let's go. Have your face makeup finished and balm up your lips because we're going to be wearing a dark lippy near the end of this video. So I need your lips to be soft and moisturized. Take this time to perfect your brows. As of lately, I've been using a brow powder to fill in my brows because I want them to look softer and natural. Hair frames the face, brows frame the eyes. Okay, let's keep moving. Because I need to change my eye color to match Riri's, Rihanna has hazel green eyes. Okay, let's break out a neutral eyeshadow palette. And loading up your brush with the matte light brown color, add this along the upper outer corner of your eyes. And in a window wiper motion, sweep back and forth, following the hollows of your eyes to create more depth to your eyes. Now, with your brush, load it up with a matte vanilla color and add this right on the center of your eyelid. Quickly, with your finger, blend it out. This will bring out the natural contours on your eyes. Using here my liquid liner in Tattoo Black, draw a thin line and sweep the brush out. Connect the lines together to create a sharp point. From here, just fill in the empty space and you have your perfectly shaped cat eye. The longer the cat eye, the more vixen your makeup will look. Very nice. Because we want super long lashes, curl them first to get them nice and perky. Using here my Tokyo Lash Mascara, apply generous coats of your favorite mascara on your lashes. And just keep combing through to get rid of the clumps. Okay, to recreate Rihanna's sexy eyes, take your liquid liner and extend the inner corner of your eye. Afterwards, just blend to soften the sharp line. Using the matte light brown color again, Add this along the lower lash line to bring more dimension to your eye makeup. This will help balance out your eyes so that it's not too top heavy. Here's where the magic happens, contouring. So I'm going to contour the sides of my nose, under the tip to lift it up, and my cheekbones. Making sure both sides are even. I'll even add a little bit on my jawline to sharpen it. Why so much contouring? Because you want to look tough so intensify the angles on your face. And let's try to avoid any visible contour streaks. It still has to look natural, so blend away. Here, just remove your lip balm to reveal soft lips. Break out your dark lipstick that's either plum, berry, brown, or black. Get it ready and with your lip brush, load it up and start sculpting your lip shape. Outlining it first, then filling it in. Paint the lipstick on until you're happy. We're not done quite yet. Time to gear up. Heavy chains and metal will toughen up your look. Instead of dainty bracelets, try a cuff. And you can totally mix silver and gold together. The more piercings, the badder you'll look. But you can cheat this look with an ear cuff. And stack them rings on. The more rings, the better. And there's no such thing as over-accessorizing for this look. I used to steal my brother's cap and wear them on backwards like this. A bad girl is a diamond in the rough, so keep shining bright. Being bad is about confidence. You're strong in your look, but kind and gentle to the good people around you. Be fierce, stay beautiful, and good luck.